today I'm going to speak on how can you make your first six figure store. Guys, me and my brother, we have been in drop shipping for a long time, a very long time, six, seven years around that. We have done multiple six and fig and six and seven figure stores. We have done multiples five figure days. Guys, you need to understand something when it comes to drop shipping. We have seen it all. We have seen all the waves, all the trends from the past six to seven years. The Facebook trend, the Instagram trend, the TikTok trend, the affiliate trend. We have seen everything. And at the end of the day, I've came up with four points that really matters. Anything else doesn't matter at all. And I'm going to share with you those four points. And I hope you follow them. Because if you really want to succeed, I believe there's no other way around. I'm not going to speak about strategies. I'm not going to speak about what you need to do, what you don't need to do in terms of testing. Because every strategy is different. I'm not here to say my strategy is better than the other one or the other one. You follow the strategy that you want. You follow what you believe is better for you because there's a lot of strategies but what is better for you is different for everyone so guys look right here 2020 400 thousand canadian dollar that's six figure right here and i'm sharing you this with you guys not to brag at all but to show you that we've came from a very poor background and now we're able to do consistently those kind of numbers and through, you know, the years, I'm going to show you numbers I have made in the past. Obviously, for obvious reason, we cannot share all the time current results because a lot of people can track, copy our website, steal our products, and you know how dropshipping works. But I promise you, over the year, I'm going to share with you guys a lot of results and you guys, or you guys are going to be happy with uh, those things. Let me know if you want me to also show you the stores that are connected with those numbers. I have access to all of those stores and I can share with you how those store looks, um, what application I actually used uh, back in the uh, back in the days. And like that, you can maybe come up with, you know, some idea of your own. So let me know if that's something that you would like to see. Like I said, we have four points that we need to speak about four strong pillars. The first one is consistency. Like anything in life, if you're not consistent, you won't make it. You won't succeed like anything in life. If you want to become a doctor in school, you need to study consistently every single week. If not, unless you're a genius, you won't make it. If you want to have a, your dream body, you need to go to the gym every single week consistently. If not, you will stay in the same place that you will stay that you're staying forever, basically. And same thing with business. If you want to have results, you need to be consistent with your testing. And I don't know how many times we say it, but people don't understand or maybe they don't want to understand or they want to do something else. But consistency is the key. Do you want to test consistently? You want to allocate a budget in order to test products consistently. This is what you need to do. Hope I'm clear and hope you guys do it because this is a really strong point and I believe that everybody should be consistent if they want to have some results. So what is the second point? Don't focus on perfection until you have money coming in. So what do I mean by this? Is a lot of people, they focus on installing 500 applications. They want to create two, three different businesses. They, they're literally making everything perfect, spending a hundred, if not thousand of dollars, and they're not making money. Guys, if you want to succeed in dropshipping, you need to set up a plan that 
doesn't cost too much and that you can keep for a long period of time and that you can do for a long period of time without breaking the bank. That That's the goal. The goal is not, oh, you test one week and after that you need to repay your debt for the next 50 years. That's not how it works. You need to manage your risk. A lot of people that I see have 500 different applications. Literally, they're paying like a bill of $300 a month with Shopify. And I I literally look at that and I'm like, why? Like the guy is not even making money. Like what's the point? Yeah, but I want to optim optimize what? You want to optimize what? You want to optimize no sales? Like zero times 500,000, it's still zero. Zero times a million, it's still zero. Start to make money and after that, optimize. After that, the other thing that I think is a very strong pillar is do more of what works. You guys need to do more of what works. Like I've seen people that have the perfect strategy. They made money. They made it. And now they're doing something else different. Something else completely different. Guys, just do more of what works. You've made 50K with this strategy. Why are you, why are you doing something else? Like if we have a nail down strategy that literally brings us money from day one, I'm going to milk that strategy. I'm going to milk it consistently, consistently. Obviously, over the years, we and you have made your money. You can allocate a budget to test different things in your strategy. You can. But when you start, every penny counts. Each one of them. And it's easy to spend thousands and thousands of dollars. And you look back, you're like, whoa, I just spent 5K in dropshipping and I haven't even made a sale. Or I made sales, but I'm no longer profitable. What do I do? Well, that's the thing. That's literally the thing. If you don't have a structure, if you don't have a mentor, if you don't have discipline, then it's just, you know, throwing everything out of the window. So just make sure that you do more of what works. Please, if you've made money, do more of that. The only moment that you want to change, let's say, do you go to the garage to fix your car, um, to the mechanic, fix your car? Do, do you go say like, oh, fix something? Nothing is broken, but fix something. You don't. You don't. But people love to do this in business. They love to fix something when it's not broken. And that's the biggest mistake. We always keep our own strategy and we only change it if needed. And the last one, but not least, is the shiny syndrome, baby. Everybody wants to jump in different trends and the Facebook trend and the TikTok trend and the Instagram influencer trend and the affiliate trend. Everyone, everybody wants to test everything. Guys, every strategy works. Each one of them works. They have their own template. They have their own way of working because each one of them works differently. And I know you see all of the dropshippers doing two, three different strategies, and it, it is working for them. Obviously, they're multimillionaires. We have multiple strategies that we are using at the same time. Why? Because we have those founds allocated to test different strategies and eventually scale with those strategies. It's a risk, but it's a calculated risk of having multiple strategies. So if you want to medi medicate the risk and lower it, then guys, just focus on one strategy and that's it. Like stop watching like 500 YouTube videos. Follow one mentor strategy and do it until it works. When it works, do more of it. Do more of it. After that, you can change your things here and there and that's it. And don't overspend your money. Don't, don't overspend your money. Guys, you work so hard to make $1, to make $5. Guys, I've worked in a hospital. I've worked in a hospital cleaning, cleaning, cleaning after old people. I'm not going to say like those things because on YouTube, it's probably not allowed, but I was cleaning <sighs> horrible things in a hospital and it was disgusting. And every penny counted. I was like, every penny that I, 
literally spend, I need to work back in the hospital to make back the money. I need to work back in the hospital to make to make back the money. And I, I was like, there's no way I would do it. So let me make sure that I don't overspend, that I can that I stay consistent, that I don't put money towards something that, you know, it's not making me money right now. It's not duplicating my money. If it's zero times 500,000, it's still zero. After that, I I just focus on one thing and one thing only because it works. I don't change my strategy. I focus on it. Eventually, you can change it. But at first, you do it until it doesn't work or until you have made enough money to put capital towards other things. And the last thing, just focus on one strategy, on one platform. Don't have the shiny syndrome because the trends come and goes. So focus on one thing. Guys, we have proof right here. And I'm going to show proof over the month and over the month and over the years. I'm going to consistently show proof of what we do. Oh, what we have done in the past, what we have done a few weeks ago, a few months ago, we show proof of everything. If you want to succeed, please follow those four pillars. It's very important because that's what made me and my brother successful. That's how you can literally make six figures like we show on this tour. So guys, wish you all an amazing rest of your day. Don't forget to follow don't forget to leave a comment. It is very appreciated. This community is growing. We're almost at 3,000 subscribers. And we're literally creating a Discord right now. My brother is focusing on making the best content inside that Discord. And I'm also there to help him. And it's going to be amazing. You guys are, you guys are going to be amazed. There's going to be so much value. And you will be able to speak with us on a daily basis, not just watch our videos and ask questions and wait a few hours before we reply. No, live action, ask us question and speak with us and you know, send us a few messages. So we're going to let you know, uh, let you guys know when this is built, when this is done, it will take time. But let me tell you, it's going to be worth it and it's going to be a very insane place for everybody. Uh, that it wants to be part of our community. So follow those four pillars. Start dropshipping if you haven't started yet. Stay consistent. Stay consistent. And wish you all an amazing rest of your day. Peace out.